How everybody doing? Welcome back to the channel. All right, so today I just wanted to do a quick tip or tutorial on how to be able to group items or uh, merge them. So I'm gonna kind of jump right into this. Uh, we see the title in there, I wanna make it quick. So you see this, I have these individual bricks and I stacked them. See, I can move them individually, but maybe I like what I did and I want those things to be grouped together, meaning as one, and I don't have to worry about it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna, basically I'm gonna hit shift and click on each of these bricks. These are everything that I want to be basically turned into one. So as I have all of these, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to over here into our outliner. I'm gonna right click, we're gonna go to group, click group, now everything is grouped. Now, good thing with that is everything's grouped. I don't have to deal with anything. I can keep it moving. If you want to ungroup it, you basically just go back here, go to ungroup. Now we are back to individual bricks. Now, let's say for instance, when we do um, group everything like I'm doing right now, we basically have all of this right we have all of these so maybe we don't want all of them all right maybe we just want one i just want one merged um block brick that has all of these that i can have down here with my static meshes so what we're going to do is i am going to go up to the tools go down to merge actors click that we're going to have everything that i selected and then we're gonna click this where it says replace source actors. And mostly it comes in like this. You're just gonna click that, make sure that that's clicked, merge actors. Then we gotta send it where we want it to go. So me, I want it to go pretty much here. So that is in the urban. We're gonna go down to urban district. We gonna go to environment. And I know this is black brick and we're gonna save it here. You can label it if you want to name something different. I have that there. Now, and I'm going to be able to, it's just going to do a little auto saving. But for the most part, what that is, is how you do uh, grouping as well as merging. So hopefully this tutorial helps you. I know it's going to help me as a reminder because a lot of this stuff in Unreal, you kind of forget. So get out there, keep creating, and I'll talk to you later.